Saturday, the second annual Eastern North Carolina Film Festival was held at Pitt Community College. Submitted films were chosen by a panel of judges, and those accepted were screened simultaneously throughout the day in genres including comedy, drama, horror, and documentary. Festival director Ron Cooper says the festival has grown exponentially in just the last year. Last year's was our first year. We had a total of 32 films and this year we had 561 submissions from local filmmakers here in eastern North Carolina to uh, throughout the nation to include international. In fact, we have 78 international films. The film festival provides producers, directors, and actors the opportunity to share their work with an audience that otherwise may not have known about their film or have had a chance to see their work. That's the whole purpose of all of this, is that we can provide them, the independent filmmaker and the independent actor, a, a spotlight, a place where that everybody can come and see them and enjoy what they do. Local filmmaker Evan Kidd is a recent East Carolina University graduate and his short film, Displacement Welcomed, was among other dramatic films screened at the festival. Filmed in Greenville, North Carolina, his film is relatable to the local audience. And we actually shot it in Greenville, North Carolina, and it features a story of a homeless woman and a young girl who meets her and the kind of sparse encounter and conversations that they strike up over the course of a day. Duke University graduate and video director and producer for the Franklin Humanities Institute at Duke University, Eric Barstow, hosted a workshop which discussed recent changes in state legislation and how it will impact the film industry in North Carolina. Basically, the legislature has decided to devote less funds towards encouraging films coming into North Carolina from Hollywood or from other um, outside studios. Barstow says while he mainly works in documentary film, the legislation will limit his ability to broaden his own experience. I have had the desire to also work on film sets in order to expose myself to like a professional Hollywood work environment. Of course, with this business drying up and with these uh, outside films no longer incentivized to come to the state, that greatly diminishes um, access to those venues for me. Barstow hopes networking opportunities like the Eastern North Carolina Film Festival will continue to encourage filmmakers to work in North Carolina despite obstacles imposed by recent changes in legislation. This festival is a great success. I think it's a, it's a fantastic opportunity to meet and network. With Tech TV, this is Carlin Legg.